Investigators identify a person of interest after a woman is shot and killed inside a northwest side Walgreens. And witnesses say he claimed to be a Chicago police officer, but CPD tells us he's not. CBS 2's Audrina Vegas is live outside the Walgreens on Fullerton and Cicero to tell us about the investigation. Hi, Audrina. Good morning, Mike and Aaron. Chicago police just told us that they've identified a person of interest in connection with this shooting, someone they want to question, but right now, no one in custody. And according to police calls that came in last night, witnesses say the shooter inside the store told them he was a Chicago police officer, but a department spokesperson says he is not a law enforcement officer or agent. A crew cleaning the crime scene inside this Walgreens on Fullerton and Cicero. It's really shocking because I heard about it at work and I'm like, oh, I come here all the time. People showed up to shop this morning, but the store was still closed 10 hours after a shooting inside. The person shot 4817 West Fullerton inside the Walgreens. A woman shot and killed around 1130 when police say the woman was shoplifting inside the store and a manager confronted her about it. Then, for some reason, another man in the store jumped into the conversation. Police say that quickly escalated to a physical altercation and the man pulled out a gun and shot the woman in the head. Are they saying it's the highest security guard in the Walgreens that shot a female shoplifter? Police radio calls came in. The employee here, they said they do not have a uh, security guard here. But uh, a witness says she did tell him that uh, he was a Chicago police officer after he threw her to the ground and fired. Chicago police say the man is not a police officer. He fled the scene in a red hoodie, driving a black or blue Ford SUV. His face and vehicle caught on these cameras at the store. It seems like um, a lot of this stuff is in this area has been tough with gang violence and, you know, weapons and gun violence is horrible. The woman who was shot in the store was pronounced dead overnight at Mount Sinai Hospital. She's in her 30s. That's what we know so far, but she has not been identified. We're live in the Belmont Cragen neighborhood. Audrina Vegas, CBS 2 News.